Mike Wallace at large on the CBS radio network. A good many people say they knew Judy Garland. Not many knew her well. This week, we're talking to those who did know Judy, her family. Apparently, it was only with them, with her children, Liza, Lorna, and Joey, that she could genuinely relax and be herself. We'll hear from the youngest of her children, her only boy, Joey Luft, after this. Here at Red Cross National Headquarters in Washington, D.C., there is a special little place to visit, a small museum reflecting a great many years of service to the American people, a hall of mercy. Down this corridor, history comes to life, a history of people helping people. There are photographs, documents, and memorabilia of Red Cross assistance during times of peace, of national crisis, and times of natural disaster, from the Civil War years to the 1970s. Great Americans are remembered here. Dedicated Red Cross volunteers who develop the vast blood program, community health and safety programs, in addition to youth service activities. And the list goes on. Yes, this is a special museum, a small tribute to those who are ever extending a helping hand just like a good neighbor. And that's what the Red Cross is all about. Was it tough being Judy Garland's son? It had it, it, it had its um. Drawbacks. Its its drawbacks. Why? But always being you know asked that question who your mom was and, but for the most part you know what I remember of, of my mom was you know really beautiful you know and I really loved her a lot. Did she sing to you? Once in a while I'd, um she'd sing and like I'd ask her to sing and she'd sing. I really loved her a lot. And then came the bad times. Well, there were there were times where it got rough, you know, when um, my mom got, you know, lowered her financial point. You and your sister Lorna used to have to watch your mother. When? Like she would get really angry, you know, and she would go into, like, yelling fits, you know, scream at anything, you know. We'd just try to, you know, calm her and control her, you know, and calm her down as best we could. There was a time... Your dad told me when you used to have to reload some of her pills? We would try to um, not give her so much, you know, so we'd load them with sugar. And sometimes she wouldn't notice it, you know. But with all of that, with the, with the, with the yelling fits and the sicknesses and the, and the noise and the meannesses, still you adored her. Oh, yeah. I adored her you know, as a mother, because that's what she was. There, there were rough times, and, the, and there were, you know, good times, and mostly what I remember are the good times. Joey Luft. Now this. I'm Mike Roy. Here's a beef tip, and rib, and round, and all the other kinds of beef cuts you can use to make a cookbook full of hearty, tasty main dishes. Like round steak Italian style, braised with zesty with those Italian spices. There's plenty of beef available at great cost for serving values. There's plenty of protein, iron, and other nutrition values, too. The Beef Industry Council of the Meat Board says beef's one of nature's priceless foods. They're so right. Tomorrow, a talk with Judy Garland's third husband, Sid Luft, on Mike Wallace at Large from CBS News.